as good as me. Or me. Hey! What are you guys doing? We were just teaching Kobe some soccer moves, Tessa style. But it's too hot to practice. Yeah, my toes are melting. Well, then maybe you'd all like a cool, refreshing glass of lemonade. Mmm, that sounds good. Yeah, I'm dying of thirst. Let me see. Three glasses of lemonade. That will be... $300 even, please. $300? Are you bananas? I think the heat's gotten to her. Well, I need to earn a million dollars somehow. Why do you need a million dollars? Because if I have a million dollars, everyone will like me. But everyone already likes you. They do? Sure we do. Yeah, even if you don't have a million dollars. Oh, well... In that case, a cool glass of lemonade for each of you on the house. That means free. Mmm. Thanks. Ah, <sighs> much better. Now I'm ready for an adventure. Aren't you guys coming? No, we're too hot. Hey, we'll come with you guys. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Perfect place for some frozen fun. Especially on such a hot day. Good thinking, Eddie. Thanks. Okay, last one to the top of the mountain is a rotten egg. Don't you mean a frozen egg? <laughs> <laughs> Jack, look! It's a pack of penguins. Whoa! But, but... <laughs> How cute. They're wearing tuxedos for a very fancy penguin dance party. Hey, look at me! I'm doing the penguin dance! Come on, Emma! The penguins love it! And they love me! Come on, try it! Well, it's not the daintiest of dances, but I'll try. <laughs> hmm. Follow me, guys. <laughs> hmm. Those penguins seem to like Jack more than they like me. Just because he can do their dance? Hmm. Oops. Say, you want to be popular with penguins? Perhaps. Then you need to act more penguin like. Lucky for you. I just happen to be a penguin expert. Well, lucky for you, I just happen to be an expert at everything. Well, almost everything. Oh, by the way, I'm Emma. Emma? That's not a very penguiny name. How about Pippa or Prudence? <gasps> Pernilla, perchance? I'll stick with Emma, thanks. Well, my name is Penelope. But you can call me Penny. Okay, Penny, how do we begin? It's always best to start at the beginning. Now, where were you hatched? Hatched? I don't think I... Okay, skip that one. Have you got anything black and white to wear? Well, no, um... Okay, skip that one, too. Hmm. Tell you what, let's start with the dip. Penguins love swimming. I 
couldn't possibly swim in there. I would freeze. You're gonna have to try harder if you want the other penguins to like you. I am trying. <sighs> then let's partake in every penguin's favorite pastime! Belly Fluffy! <laughs> Go on, try it. No problem. I'm sure I can flop. <laughs> I got snow in my mouth. <gasps> Great idea! Snow cones! They're this penguin's personal favorite. Particularly sardine-flavored snow cones. Uh... Go on, try it. All penguins love it. Okay. Delicious, isn't it? Oh, the other penguins are sure to like you now. You're becoming more like us every minute. Emma! Thank goodness I found you. My penguin pals want to throw a fancy party. They do? That's my specialty. I know. I told them you are the expert at fancy things. But what's happened to you? I was trying to be more like a penguin so that everybody would like me. Like you? But everyone always likes you, the way you usually are. You know, all perfect and everything. Really? Of course. You're the most perfect person I know. I am? Well, you were. Nobody wants you to be a penguin. We like you when you're you. Are you going to eat this? <laughs> Much better. Thanks for your help, Penny. But I think I'll leave being a penguin to the penguins. Now about that party. Party? Yes, I'm going to plan the most fancy, most perfect penguin party ever. <laughs> wow! Yeah! Great! Now, the best parties always have a theme and a bold color scheme. How about black and white? <laughs> Sophie, why does Lucky like you so much? Hmm. Because you rub his tummy? I don't think so. Because you give him treats? No, I doubt it. Because you play with him all the time? Well, maybe for all those reasons. A little bit. But mostly because puppies just like you no matter what. Puppies don't care about stuff like we do. They don't even care if you like pink or like blue. Puppies don't care if you're strong or you're weak. They don't pay much notice to the language you speak. Little, little doggies, they don't judge you in advance. We can all be more like them and give everyone a chance. Puppies don't care if you're big or you're small. They don't like you better if you're short or you're tall. Puppies don't care if you're fat or you're thin. They pay no attention to your hair or your skin. Little, little doggies, they don't touch you in advance. We could all be more like them and give everyone a chance. Puppies don't care if you lose or you score. They don't ever think about who's rich or who's poor. Puppies don't care if you can't climb a tree. They like you if you're fully grown or just a baby. Little, little doggies, they don't judge you in advance. We could all be more like them and give everyone a chance. Little, little doggies wagging tails with all they've got. We could learn a lot from puppies, they're our friends no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Tweet, 
bird ships allowed. We're birds. You can be a bird, too. A goose? Or a pigeon. I don't want to be a bird. Zoom! Rocket ships over there, birds over here. Who made you boss of the sky? <sighs> I don't even want to be a rocket ship anymore. Hmm. I'm a flying dinosaur. Roar! Roar! Tweet! Tweet! Caw! 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 <laughs> Good doggy! Yes, you are! Yes, you are! Now I'll show you how to stay. Stay! Good boy! <laughs> Roar! Roar! Eddie, slow down! You'll scare Lucky! <laughs> I can't slow down! Roar! Not until I land in... the dinosaur nest! Roar! Look out! Pterodactyl Eddie is landing! Ah! No, ah! Eddie, don't! Knock over my sandcastle. But this is my nest. It was a sandcastle, but you landed on it. <sighs> don't land here anymore. <sighs> don't land. No rocket ships allowed. Slow down! So many rules! I want to go someplace where everyone wants to do the same things I want to do. Like maybe an adventure? Yeah, that's it! I'm going on an adventure to have my kind of fun with my kind of friends. <sighs> Take it away, Ziggy! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure, and you can come along. A special kind of adventure, but first we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. We sing this song. We sing this We sing this song. got an adventure and we're extra so excited so here we go adventure ho and everyone's invited except this time i'm the only one invited because it's my adventure hmm. okay eddie is ready to have some fun Let's get this party started. Just need to find the perfect spot. Hey, Eddie. Oh, hey, Eddie. Huh? Eddie? Yeah, Eddie? Uh, are you me? I thought you wanted to have some fun. Um, yeah, I do. Well, I know the best place where we can do things the Eddie way. Really? Yeah. Everybody's ready? Everybody's steady? Cause everybody's Eddie! Yay! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah! Nobody knows how to have fun like Eddie. Right, Eddies? Ah! Yahoo! You said! Right? Welcome to Eddie Land. <laughs> You're it! <laughs> hey! Slow down! How can I tag you? You can't! Fun, right? Uh, I guess so. Hey, Eddie!
Huh? Yeah! Higher! No! Lower! Lower! Higher! Higher! Uh-oh. A little peace and quiet. Hey, Eddie! Hmm. So, buddy. Yo, Eddie! Eddie! Yahoo! Over here! Oh, no. Not more Eddies. Wahoo! Wait up, Eddie! know how to play nicely? Like my friends at home. No. 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 Nope. Oh, yeah. Ah! Oh, yeah. Woohoo! Wahoo! This is amazing! Phew. Need a hand? Huh? What? How did you... I mean... From Tessa Land. And I'm a Mia bird from Mia Land. We were just flying by and thought you could use a little help. Uh, yeah. I could use a lot of help from friendly friends. Well, that's what we're here for. You can be an Eddie bird from Eddie Land. Just flap your wings. <laughs> I mean, your arms. Okay. What? Now we get to go home. Yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you. You birds are the best. Ooh, 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 ooh. Can't have a sand castle without a flag. Uh, thanks. Oh, yeah. Yahoo! Whoa! Take cover! Stay. Stay. Good boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Really? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Can I play birds too? We're not birds anymore. Now we're dolphins. Oh, okay then. I'm a dolphin too. <laughs> hmm. Uh, Eddie, what are you doing? <laughs> Playing dolphins. But what happened to your game? I had enough of doing things the Eddie way. Hey, why don't we all play dolphins together? Yeah! yeah! Let's do it! Now, does anyone have a fish stick? This dolphin's starving. <laughs> <laughs> Can Tessa, the tornado, fly through the hoop of doom? You can do this, Tessa. <clears throat> of course she can. Hooray! That was great, Tessa. But you might want to work on your bow. Just a teeny tiny bit. Why? What's wrong with it? Nothing's wrong with it. It could just be more right. See? How about like this? Ta-da! But I like bowing Tessa style. But this is the right way. Hey, I know. Why don't we ask King Piglot? People must bow in front of him all the time. Great idea! Oh, boy! <laughs> <laughs> 
Let's go! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. Come along now. We mustn't dilly-dally. King Pigalot, we were just looking for you. Oh, yes. Can you tell us who is bowing the right way? I'm afraid I haven't got time. I'm having a party this evening. So much to do. A party? Yes, a royal ball to be precise. Why don't you come along? Really? Sounds fun. We'll be there. Oh, splendid. Party, you say? Oh, uh, hello, Queen of Jungle Land. King Pigalot, I'm having a party tonight, too. It's going to be so much fun, and you're all invited. <laughs> but I asked them first. Well, they might want to come to mine instead. There'll be yummy food. My party has yummy food. And dancing. My party has dancing, too. And an all-monkey band. I have an all-monkey band. Get an all-monkey band, quickly. Well, they both sound fun. Good. Excellent. I'll, I'll see, you see you tonight, tonight at, at my party. party. Come along now. <laughs> Now what do we do? Yeah, if we don't go to the queen's party, she'll be upset. And if we don't go to the king's party, he'll be upset. I know. Why don't we go to both parties? Good idea. Yeah! Let's go! <laughs> yes, quite excellent. <laughs> ah, welcome, welcome. You're just in time for the royal feast. It looks delicious. Please, dig in. Eat. Eat like pigs. Excuse me! <laughs> Thanks! Is that the Queen of Jungle Land's all monkey bands? Yeah! We'd better get over to her party. Leave it to me! Where are you going? Don't worry, Your Majesty. We'll be back soon. But we were having such a wonderful party. Do hurry back. Yes, in time for the dancing. We'll be here. Promise. <laughs> Just in time to dance. Ooh, ooh. all right! <laughs> ooh, ooh. Ah, ah, ah. You're a natural. The funky monkey is my favorite. I prefer the tortoise twist. Whee! <laughs> <gasps> Prince Piggington, what are you doing here? Um, well, you said you'd come back, and well, it's time to dance now. Please and thank you. Well, I guess we better go then. See you later, your royal tortoise nest. Where are you going? Not back to King Pigalot's party. We promise. Well, promise me you'll be back in time for my royal fireworks. You won't want to miss that. We'll be back, don't worry. Wow, 
This is some pig shindig. I knew you'd come back. And in thanks, you shall have the honor of dancing with my son. Oh, thank you. Quite the dancer, that boy. Taught him everything he knows. Ouchie! So sorry. Hmm? Queen of Jungle Land? What are you doing here? You're not my guest. I came to collect my guests. They're about to miss the fireworks. Well, my guests are enjoying the dancing. They want to watch the fireworks. But my laser light show is starting shortly, and they'll want to watch that. Sorry to interrupt, Your Majesties. But isn't there a way we can watch the fireworks and the light show? That's impossible! My light show is here. My fireworks are way over there. What if we have the party halfway between the jungle and Pigalot Castle? Yeah! Then we could watch the fireworks and the light show at the same time. Hmm. <coughs> well... I'm not sure at all about this. Yes, it doesn't feel quite right. Well, catchy tune, though. Yeah, it's a real shell shaker. Say, you dance quite royally. <laughs> and you're not half bad either. Yes! Fireworks, Queenie. And your lasers are spectacular. What a show. Quite. I must say, this is the best royal party ever. Thanks to our guests of honor. No problem. Anytime. Our pleasure. Um, your highnesses, isn't this the proper way to bow? Yes, yes, absolutely. I knew it. In fact... All of your bows look perfectly proper to me. Oh, yes. You all bow beautifully. Oh, rats. <laughs> <laughs> on my scooter! You're too fast! I thought zebras were fast. But it's not fair, Jack! <sighs> you can't just stop. I'm not playing. Hey, guys, what's up? I want to race with the zebra. And I want to race with the scooter. Can't you figure out a way to do both? Huh? Yeah. How are we gonna do that? You'll see. Ready, steady, go! We Go, Jack! Go, Anna! Yay, Zebra Scooter! <sighs> Phew! Water! Water! <sighs> okay, Eddie. Good boy. I've got some water for you. <sighs> Better? <sighs> yeah. Phew. So hot. It's like a billion degrees out here. Isn't it, Kobe? Uh, oh, yeah. I guess so. You guess so? What's the matter, Kobe? I just found out the worst thing ever. <gasps> what is it? 
You're allergic to all of us? There's a law against dancing? There's no more peanut butter on planet Earth? Worse than all of those. <sighs> What's worse? Tell us. Please. Come on. <sighs> I'm moving to a new house. Oh, no! But, Kobe! What about Ziggy and the band? And Lucky? And all of us! And all our adventures! Yeah! I've lived in that house and that room my whole life, since I was little. It's where I... where I live! <sighs> oh, Kobe, I'm sorry. This is the worst news ever. Hey! Why don't we do something that'll cheer us up? Yeah! Like go on an adventure! We could go somewhere nice and cold, like Snow Globia. That sounds great, doesn't it, Kobe? <sighs> I guess so. Yeah! Come on, Kobe. It'll be fun. Okay. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. 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 Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And we're extra so excited. So here we go. Kobe, I'll race you. That's okay. I don't feel like racing. <sighs> huh? Wee! <Yeah! laughs> Excuse me. Uh, uh, have you seen any trees around here? Uh, I don't think I. What do you want a tree for? I'm looking for a new place to live. Really? Why? My mom and dad brought home my new baby sister, and there's no way I'm sticking around with her there. Why not? Are you kidding? Ugh, all they talk about is new baby this and new baby that. And I was there first. But having a little sister might be fun. Think of all the cool stuff you could teach her. Think of all the noise she makes. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Look at my snowman. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm just going to take a little walk. Okay, see you, Kobe. Hurry back. Hey, wait up. I'm Kobe, by the way. Gabriel. So, don't you think your parents will miss you if you find somewhere else to live? They won't even notice I'm gone. <sighs> I just want things to go back to the way they were. I don't want things to change. Yeah, me neither. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> Whoa! Oops! Sorry. No worries. <clears throat> Delicious snowball. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you know if there are any empty igloos around here? Mm, don't think so. Why? He's got a new baby sister, and he doesn't want to hang around. Oh, <laughs> I understand. I have a kid brother. You do? Yep, and he's my best little buddy ever. He is? Sure, but I didn't think so at first. But things change. Well, I don't want any change. Change isn't always easy. I wasn't too happy when my parents moved us all here from the warm jungle. You moved here? All the way from the jungle? Yeah, and I thought I would be miserable. But you know what? Snow is so fun! Who knew? At first it wasn't easy to leave my home behind. My parents said, don't worry, soon we think you'll find. Things can change, feel kind of strange. Sometimes it's just that way. But something new might tickle you and brighten up your day. Cha-cha-cha. 
My brother, isn't he the cutest? Looks like he can be fun to have a sister or brother. And guess what, Mom and Dad said we're gonna have another. It feels kind of strange when things start to change, but sometimes it's just that way. But something new might tickle you <laughs> and brighten up your day. Cha -cha. Change, change is the way. See you later, Herbie. Come on, I want to show you two something. <laughs> change is the way. What is this place? Place, place? This is Echo Canyon. Canyon, Canyon. Hello! 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 You can hear things from all over Snowglobia if you listen. <laughs> That's my mom and dad. They're calling me to come home. <laughs> Sounds like they might be a little worried about you. Yeah, well, maybe. <laughs> Is that my sister? It must be my sister! Sister, sister, sister. <laughs> sounds like she really misses her big brother. And it sounds like you two might want to go and see her. Kobe, want to meet my new sister? Absolutely! But what about finding an igloo? No thanks! I've got some other changes in mind. 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 Thanks, Edna. 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 <laughs> 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 You're so cute. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kobe. <laughs> Your friend's family sure is happy that he's back home. His little sister is so cute! <laughs> hmm, maybe some changes aren't so bad. Things can change, feels kind of strange. Sometimes it's just that way. But something new might tickle you and brighten up your day. Cha cha, cha cha, cha. Exactly are you moving? Tomorrow. Oh, rats! I don't want you to go. I'm actually kind of excited. You are? But we'll never see you again. Sure you will. But you'll be so far away. Oh, no! No, no, no! I'm not moving far away. I'm just moving across the street. Across, across the, the street? street? Yeah. Exactly 22 steps from where I live now. But I'm really gonna miss my bedroom, and my window, and my closet, and my floor, <laughs> and my ceiling, and my doorknob, and where I drew pictures of you guys on my wall. Higher! Push harder! If I push any harder, my arms will fall off. Sophie, can you help Mia? <laughs> okay. I wanna go higher! Tessa, Kobe, can you help push me really high? Sure. Okay. Come on. Here goes. Uh, higher. Uh, We're trying our best. Uh, if 
you want to go higher, <gasps> maybe we should go someplace you can swing really high. I know! What about the jungle? I can swing on the vines. And we won't have to push you. Yeah, come on! Let's go! With you in a second, as soon as I can stop swinging. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. Sing this song. Sing this song. You were born in the jungle? Does that mean you're a monkey? No, but I'd like to be. I love all the jungle animals. Monkeys, uh, birds, elephants, and penguins. Penguins? Hi. Hi. I didn't know penguins live in the jungle. Are you a jungle penguin? No, no. I'm not from the jungle. But it always looked like such a fun place. I thought I'd come and see it for myself. You'll love it. Yeah. Well, wait till you meet all the cool animals. We can show you around. Yeah. I know this jungle like my own backyard. Just follow me. Yes. Let's go. It'll be fun. I'm sure the jungle birds are around here somewhere. You've got to meet them. Um, Eddie? Oh, yes, he's one of my dearest friends. Bingo! <laughs> Hi. I'm Pickles. Nice to meet you. Hmm, what an interesting bird you are. You are a bird, aren't you? Oh, yes, definitely. See? Wings, beak, feathers. He's a penguin. Hmm. Charming. He's new to the jungle. New, you say? Well, the best way to see the jungle is from way up in the sky. I suppose we birds can take you for a quick fly around. Well, you see, I don't fly. You don't fly? Who ever heard of a bird who doesn't fly? I can swim, though. Underwater. Pretty impressive, huh? Well, swimming's not much use to us, I'm afraid. Why don't you see if they can show you around? Can't fly! Can you believe it? But... Sorry, gotta fly! Bye. Don't worry, Pickles. There are lots of other animals in the jungle besides the slappy birds. Yeah, like the monkeys. They're always in the mood for fun. Come on, I know exactly where they live. They usually hang around here. Um, Eddie? Oh, hi. Oh, oh, ah, ah! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> 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 oh, thanks. I've never swung on vines before, but let's give it a try. Are you okay? Um, yeah, thanks. <laughs> but I don't think my little flippers were made for swinging. <laughs> Ooh, ah, ah. Oh, thank you. What a funny looking fish. You've never seen a banana? No, but it looks delicious. <laughs> I brought some sardine sandwiches. They're my favorite. Here. See what you think. Well, that 
was rude. Oh. Don't worry, Pickles. We can look for other jungle friends with you. Yeah! Like the elephants. Let me call and see if they're around. <clears throat> they must be out of town. Maybe I can try. Sure, but it's not as easy as it looks. I think they're on their way. <laughs> Pickles, why don't you try? Well, okay. <laughs> Maybe I just don't fit in. What do you mean? I'm different from everybody here. There's nothing wrong with being different. Yeah, being different is a really good thing. We just need to remind the animals. Come on! See their elephant? Can you swing on a vine? Have you seen the monkeys do it? They're swinging all the time. Wait a minute, monkeys. Has anyone heard? You can flap your wings and fly just like a bird. <laughs> See, nobody does things just like you. But that's what makes me me and makes you you. You, you, makes you you. You, you, makes you you. Hey, Mr. Peacock, can you make a big sound? Like an elephant blasting his trunk all around. <laughs> Oh my, that is difficult. See everyone here is something different to say. So they're doing their own thing and that's the funnest way. See, I might not do things just like you, but that's what makes me me. Makes you you, you, you makes you you. No, I don't do things the way you do, but you can like me and I can like you. You, you makes you you. I like you, you, you makes you you. I like you. <laughs> I must say, I do like the way you walk. Maybe he can show you how. Oh, that would be splendid. You just have to walk around and make sure you give it a bit of a wiggle, like this. <laughs> Why, I feel different already. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, Lucky and I are going to be Dorothy and Toto. And you three can play the other parts. What are the other parts? Well, Dorothy and Toto go up in a big storm and land in a magical place and meet witches. Yeah, there's a good witch and a bad witch, and I want to play a magical part. I love magic. Um, okay. Then you're the witch, Emma. Oh, I've always wanted to be the good witch with a beautiful dress and a big crown and... I meant the bad one, the Wicked Witch of the West. The mean, old, ugly one. Oh. And Tessa, you can be the good witch, Glinda. What about me? Um... I know. You can play the Witch of the East, the one the house falls on. But we really only need to see your feet. I guess they'll do. Okay, is everybody ready? Mia, why do you get to be Dorothy? What do you mean? I mean, why do we all have to play witches and you get to play Dorothy? But I'm not Dorothy. But you said you and Lucky were Dorothy and Toto. That's right. Lucky is Dorothy. I'm Toto. <laughs> <laughs> of a dinosaur. How did you guess? Vroom. And you're an airplane. Oh. And hello, 
there, Mr. Froggy. Ribbit, ribbit. You are a ballerina. No, a teapot. Sophie, you're supposed to be a statue. How can I guess what you are if you don't keep still? But I have so many ideas. Like a clock, a rocket ship, a starfish, a chimpanzee, kangaroo. Oh, wait, I have one more. Look! What am I? What am I? Santa Claus? No, I'm a beach ball. Boing, boing, boing. Oh, yeah. I love, love, love the beach. Me too. Hey, I know. How about we go to the beach? Yeah, it'll be an adventure. Let's go. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. 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 Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And we're extra so excited. So here we go. We were just about to have a scavenger hunt. I love scavenger hunts. What's a scavenger hunt? You get a list of things to find, and the first team to find them wins. That sounds fun. Can we play? Yep, yep, you sure can. Tell you what, why don't you go on one team, and the beavers can be on the other team? Sounds great. Thank you. Woohoo! Great. Now, here's a list of the stuff you have to find. A flashlight. A scarf a map, and a snail. And remember, they're hidden all over the island. All right! Come on! Let's go! Oh, wait a second. What do we win? Win? Why, it's a surprise! But the items you collect are a little bit of a clue. First team back here wins. Good luck! I'll find the scarf. No, the flashlight. No, the snail. Definitely the snail. Okay, I'll find the flashlight. And I'll find the scarf. I guess that leaves the map. Let's go! Now, if I were a scarf, where would I hide? Maybe somewhere out of the way? Up high, where no one could see me. Aha, there you are. <laughs> Don't worry, little scarf. I'm coming to get you. Oh, oh rats. I mean, beavers. <laughs> Not so fast. I believe that's my scarf. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, Mr. Snail! Here, Mr. Snail. There you are. Oh. What do you know? This rock has a smiley face on it. This would be a perfect addition to my collection of happy smiling rocks. The snail's gone! Oh, Mr. Snail, come back! Could that be the flashlight? Or could it be... <gasps> A cave monster! With, with big, sharp teeth and big claws and... <sighs> A teeny tiny shell. It's just a little snail. <laughs> Hey, 
That means I found two clues. Huh? Where did you go? Now, Mr. Snail, are you hiding from me? Oh, hi. I knew you wouldn't hide from your old pal, Sophie. What have you got there? <gasps> Could this be? A banana trumpet! This is the perfect addition to my musical fruits collection. Don't you think? Mr. Snail, where did you go this time? I've searched this whole island. Left to right and top to bottom. I can't find a map anywhere. <gasps> Whoa! <gasps> a map! Of course. Only a beaver would make a map out of wood. Tessa! Tessa! I found my clue! Great, Eddie! I found my clue, too! All right! Let's get back to show everyone! Seashell! 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 Snail shell! Aha! Can't fool me, Mr. Snail! Come on! We better hurry! But hang me on a second. What is that? Sand pancakes! They are so rare! I've got to add one to my Sandy Snacks collection. Mmm! Delicious! Oh, Mr. Snail! Not again! Come on, Sophie! Hurry up, Sophie! We can still win! We just need the snail! I'm sorry, guys. I haven't been able to catch it yet. Woohoo! I got it! I got it! Look, he has a snail! Which means the beavers are the winners! We did it this time! <laughs> winners! Sophie, where's your snail? Yeah, what's all that stuff you're carrying? Well, I kept finding all these great things for my collections and kept losing the snail. But the snail would have helped us to win. I know. I kept getting distracted. I should have been concentrating. I'm sorry. Oh, Sophie. Yep. Well, better luck next time. So, what would we have won? Yeah, what are all the items for? Oh, the winners get to fly in my hot air balloon at night. The map is to help plan the route. The flashlight helps us see where we're going and the scarves to keep warm. It gets real chilly up there. But what about the snails? Oh, they're just my little pets. I'm always losing them. Oh, there you are. Come on then, beavers. Let's fly! I can't oh, wait! This is I'm great. gonna fly! I this is gonna be great! This there. is gonna be great! A nighttime flight would have been so fun. Wait a second. I'm sure I've got somewhere. Yes! My special collection of glow-in-the-dark balloons! Come on! Before we miss takeoff! Lovely night for a balloon ride. Can I get some light on the map, please? Hey, beavers! Yahoo! Hello, beavers! We're flying, too! It's so pretty up here! Can I wear the scarf now? Yes, yes, in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Kobe! Just a minute. I'm concentrating. Oh, yeah? On what? Well, if I concentrate hard enough, I think I can make Lucky fly. Oh, we can help. Great! I think we've got one problem. Gravity is concentrating even harder than us. I think you're right. That gravity, it's always getting in the way. Never mind, Lucky. When I'm older, I'm going to be an astronaut. You can fly in my spaceship. Throw. 
Whoa! Hey, that wasn't me. It was the wind. Tessa? Why are you making that noise? It's not me. It's the wind blowing through the treehouse. Sounds like the wind is up to all kinds of tricks today. It's like the singing flowers in fairy tale land, but spookier. <laughs> I'll take the flowers in fairy tale land any day. Then come on, let's go to fairy tale land. And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Just a minute. Not today, Mr. Sheep. Coming through. <clears throat> Excuse me? My name is Simon, and well, it's just that we need a little help. Ugh, I'm really in a hurry. We're going to hear the singing flowers. <laughs> but we're lost, and we don't know how to get home. Well. Please. Oh, rats. All right, I'll help you. But you've got to be quick. Oh, thank you. <sighs> Come on. How hard can it be to find a sheep field? Let's try this way. On the double. So, what does your field look like anyway? Oh, there's grass. Lots of it. And a hedge. There's a big green hedge of bushes. Well, that helps. Maybe someone in the garage will know where to find your field. <gasps> Hello, your royal fairy princess nets. Are you in need of a pumpkin coach today? No, not today. Today I'm here for these sheep. Hmm, do your sheep take regular or unleaded gas? <laughs> I think they run on grass, not gas. But you still might be able to help them. They're lost. Completely lost. Do you know how to get to their field? <laughs> oh, why, yes, of course. The sheep live in the field right along the lane. Oh, thanks, Mr. Dumpty. Wait. There are lots of fields down that way. Which one is it? The one way down there, near the end. You'll know you're there when you see its red gate. But that's way, way, way far away. It'll take forever to walk all the way down there. Yes, it will. If only there was a quicker way to move your sheep. Ah, well, I'm sure you'll think of something. Yes! I have an idea. Simon, can you drive? Sheep make excellent drivers. Ah. Mr. Humpty, do you mind if we borrow these cars? Be my guest. Thanks. Well, Simon, there you go. Cars for everyone. So, good luck. Um, ma'am, what if we get lost again? Oh, you won't. Just go all 
all the way to the end of the lane and look for the red gate. Gotta go. Oh, well, okay. <gasps> Simon, you're going the wrong way. <sighs> no wonder little Bo Peep lost her sheep. They're still moving and grooving. Where have you been, Mia? Oh, I was helping some lost sheep find their field. That was nice of you. Did they find it okay? Well, I think so. Which way did she say to go? Uh, maybe it was this way? But we're in a traffic jam. Don't worry, I'll help you. I've got a much better idea this time. What's your idea, Mia? Instead of all the sheep driving alone in their own cars and making all this noise and smog, I'll take them all home. Ta da! In a bus! What a great plan, Mia! They'll all fit in there, no problem. Right! One bus won't cause all the stinky smog that those cars did. And no more loud engines and honking horns. And nobody will get lost because I know the way. All aboard! Come on, gang! Ah. 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 Bus go ba 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 ba. There is lots to see on this planet. That is true, other head. But what should we see first? Hey, two-headed alien thing. Do you want to play catch? Oh yes. I mean, affirmative. <laughs> <laughs> But this head wants to see what those two Earthlings are up to. But this head's data bank says that playing catch is more fun. My data bank thinks your data bank is a little bit rusty. <laughs> hey! 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 Why don't we all do something together? Um, er... Spinning in circles look fun. Actually, this head agrees. So does this one. It is fun. Hee ha. Hee hee hee. Whoa! 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 
Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Whoa! Whoa! What you doing, Selfie? Watering the plants. Mia, what you doing that for? I don't think they were feeling very good. They were all dry and turning brown. But I gave them a good drink. And look, all better. Mia, that's really nice of you, Sophie. Mia? Yes, Tessa? Can you stop spinning me now? I'm getting dizzy. Oops, sorry. Dizzy? Aw, I hate feeling dizzy. Hey, maybe I can make you feel better, too. Let me take a look. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. Uh, Sophie, I'm fine. Just needed to stop spinning. When I grow up, I'm going to be a doctor. I can make anything feel better. Anything? <sighs> Plants, people, anything. Hmm. What about dogs? And animals? Dogs are animals. I know that. Animals? They're my specialty. Hey, you know where there are lots of animals? The farm! We could go there and Sophie can make all the animals feel better. Yeah, like a real aquarium. You mean a veterinarian? Yeah, that too. Great idea! Well, yay! yay! Let's go! And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Sing this song Sing this song We sing this song, sing this song. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure Sheep is fine. Fine? Listen to it. It's croaking <laughs> like a frog. <laughs> but don't worry. I'll make it all better. But Sophie, look! <laughs> the sheep doesn't have a frog in his throat, but Eddie's got one under his hat. How did he get under there? <laughs> oh, okay. All better now. Hmm. <laughs> Poor little piggy. What's the matter, Sophie? She's got a bad case of curly tail. See? Don't worry. I'll have this tail straightened out in no time. But Sophie, pigs' tails are supposed to be like that. You know, all curly. They are? Hmm. I guess they are. Say that 
that you hear ringing in your ears? I thought so. Do you hear the ringing a lot? Hmm. This might be something very serious. Maybe come back, Cat! You might need a brain transplant. <gasps> I guess it could be the bell. <sighs> there must be someone that needs my help. And maybe that's him. Hi, Bernie. Uh, oh. Guys, the doctor needs some help. <laughs> oh. I think maybe there is something really wrong with Bernie. What could it be? Beats me. But there's definitely something wrong. Well, it's a good thing I'm here. Are your legs broken? No. <sighs> oh, no. Didn't think so. Hmm. I bet you have a really bad tummy ache, right? No. Wrong again. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Mm. <laughs> Wait, I heard a sniffle. I wonder if he has a cold or the flu. Why can't people leave me alone? Have you figured out what's the matter? No, not yet. So that leaves us only one choice. We'll have to operate. Operate? That's what doctors do. Wait a minute. Did you ask him about how he feels and why he's acting sad? Um, you know, not exactly. Well, come on! Bernie, we're worried about you. Yeah, you're just so down. So, we were wondering, what exactly is the matter, Bernie? I don't really know. I'm just a little bit sad. For no reason? No reason. So you're just feeling a little bit down? Yeah, I must have woken up on the wrong side of the barn or something. <sighs> That's okay, Bernie. Oh, Bernie. Mm. There you go, boy. It's okay. Aw, oh, thanks, guys. Sometimes I'm in a bad mood for no reason at all. Yeah, me too. But then it disappears. Baby. Just like Eddie's hat. Come back, hat! Baby. Baby. Mm. Baby. Mm. Baby. You know, that is pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> Some help! Yeah! Come on! Eddie, we're coming! <laughs> <laughs> Sophie, do you think Lucky's okay? Sure he's okay. He's just doing what he likes to do best. Taking a nap. It's his best trick. <laughs> 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 What in the name of bouncing bandages is going on here? What do you mean? The bandages. Did you fall off your scooter? Oh, no. I'm a mummy. I'm going back to the pyramids. Just as soon as I find my mummy tiara. Eddie, give me back my tiara! But I'm an explorer. I'm supposed to find stuff. I'll help you, Mia. Me too. And me. <laughs> Eddie! Ah! Huh? What? <laughs> Don't worry. I'm okay. Eddie, do you need a bandage? Wait, I'm the doctor. Huh? Now, Eddie, just tell me where it hurts. <laughs> <laughs> Eddie has the ball. 
Can he throw it to Kobe? Or will Sophie block the shot? The crowd falls silent. Eddie, it's just a game of monkey in the middle. Yeah, would you throw the ball already? Give it your best shot, Eddie. Go on, Eddie. We're ready. It's now or never. I got it, I got it. <laughs> I don't got it. <laughs> Ew. Pass me the ball, Emma. No, to me. You can't play with this. It's all slobbery. It's fine. It is kind of slobbery. But we're having such a fun game. We could play with something else. We could play somewhere else, too. I know. Let's play monkey in the middle with real monkeys. Snow monkeys. And we could play with snowballs. An adventure to Snow Globia. Yeah. Great idea. Yeah. Fun. Yeah. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Wait to play monkey in the middle with us. Okay, monkeys, get ready. Yeah! <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> Heads up, Emma! <laughs> now try this, monkeys. <laughs> I got it! Come on! Wow! You're the cutest, sweetest, most adorable little stuffed animal ever! You're soft like a teddy bear, but you're a fish. <gasps> a teddy fish! I'm so glad I found you. You can come and live with me. But Emma, that teddy fish doesn't belong to you. What do you mean? I found it, and I'll give it such a good home. It must belong to somebody. It looks like it's been played with a lot. See? Someone might have lost it and be really sad. <laughs> Heads up, Emma! <laughs> <laughs> what? Where are you going? Sorry, everyone. I'm going to try and find whoever this teddy fish belongs to. <gasps> Wait! Ugh. I'm coming with you. <laughs> <laughs> My hat! Come on, guys, give it back! Found any clues yet? Nope. Good. Because you're my teddy fish. Yes, you are. Emma, we have to return it if we can. If I find it, then I keep it. That's the finder's keeper's rule. It's the first thing that they teach you in finder's keeper school. <sighs> Emma, there's no such thing. What's mine is mine, and what's yours is mine, too. So I'm done. Much better plan. Cause if someone loves it just like you, then finding that someone is the right thing to do. Back, back, give it back. Back, back, give it back. It doesn't belong to you. Hey, maybe Mrs. Rabbit saw something that could give us a clue. Oh, great. Excuse me, Mrs. Rabbit. Have you seen this teddy fish before? Hmm, it is mighty familiar. Do you know who it belongs to? I can't quite remember who I saw snuggling it. Maybe try over by the slide. That's where all the penguins play. Next stop, the slide. Thanks 
Mrs. Rabbit. You're welcome, sweetie. Bye now. You know, Sophie, I was thinking... Hey, what about if someone got a newer fish one day? And didn't want this old thing, so they just threw it away. What's mine is mine, and what's yours is mine, too. So I'm gonna keep it all if I could dream come true. Give it back, if you can. Giving back's a much better plan. Cause if someone loves it just like you, then finding that someone is the right thing to do. Maybe they'll lead us to whoever lost the teddy fish. Oh, goody. Sophie. What if the fish belonged to a huge and hairy beast with 20 catching claws and a million teeth at least? What's mine is mine and what's yours is mine too. So I'm gonna keep it all. It's like a dream come true. Give it back if you can. Giving back's a much better plan. Cause if so The right thing to do. If someone loves it just like you, then finding that someone is the right thing to do. Aww. Hey, monkeys! No! Look! What if the teddy fish was lost by a penguin? But which one? in the snow, and I really do love it. But it's yours, and I would feel sad if I lost something and someone else kept it. Emma, that was really nice of you. Oh, thanks, Sophie. And look, you've got an even cuter friend to hug. <laughs> Mother, that's me, gave her a pair of glass slippers so she could dance at the prince's ball. Ugh. Wow, these slippers are the best for dancing in. The next thing Cinderella knew... Uh-oh, I lost one. Cinderella ran off to look for her slipper, but the prince found it. I must find who this belongs to. Then they can come back to the ball and dance with me. The prince asked Cinderella's evil stepsisters, who really, really, really wanted to dance with him. So they decided to trick the prince. If the slipper fits, then I'll know it belongs to you, and we can dance. So one of the evil stepsisters selfishly pretended it was her slipper. But wait, that slipper actually belongs to Cinderella. No! Don't say that! You're supposed to be evil! Tell the prince it belongs to you! But it's not my slipper. It's Cinderella's slipper. And you should always give back what doesn't belong to you. Cinderella! What? Wait! Hey, my slipper! A perfect fit! Would you like to come back to the ball and dance with me? And bring your lovely stepsisters! Evil stepsisters! <sighs> and they danced happily ever after. All of them together. The end. <sighs> I found this and I think it belongs to you. 
Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> and now, from the greatest backyard on Earth, or any planet, but I'm only guessing, here's Sophie! Thank you, thank you! We've got a great show for you today. Songs, jokes, adventure. But first, it's time for everyone's favorite game show. Convince Mia to let you borrow her most beautiful tiara in the whole world. <laughs> Remember, you can sing, you can dance, but you cannot lie. Only tell the truth. First up, Kobe. Uh, Mia, can I borrow your tiara because it's pretty? Mmm, that's true, but no. Good try. Eddie, you're up. Please, Mia, please. May I borrow your tiara? I don't know. More pleases. And this time, sing them and dance. Please, 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 please. With a scoop of strawberry ice cream. You'll really give me a scoop of strawberry ice cream? Yes, and I'll take really good care of your tiara. And that's the truth. Well, okay. And the winner is Eddie! Steady Eddie is ready to roll. Who wants to take a trip to the jungle? I do. Me too. Are there butterflies in the jungle? Oh yeah, there's lots of butterflies. Then I'll come too. Okay, away we go. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. Special kind of adventure. But first, we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. to wear your tiara? The Queen of Jungle Land. That's who. What a great idea. What do you think, Mia? Uh, Mia? Mia? Mia! Shh! You'll scare away the butterfly. We want to crown the Queen of Jungle Land with your tiara. But I want to stay here and watch the butterfly. That's okay. We'll go by ourselves. Hmm. Here. Oh, um, whoops. Aha! Walkie talkies. This way we can stay in touch. Just press the button and you can talk to us. And make sure your tiara is safe and sound. Well, okay. Great. Gotta go. Can't keep a queen waiting. Okay, bye. Hey, come back here. Okay, guys. So we're here, and the Jungle Queen's throne is there. Eddie, look at this map. Um, Eddie, that rock can walk. That's not a rock. It's a tortoise. Mia to Eddie. Over. Uh-oh. Hello there, Mia. My tiara is safe, right? Oh, of course, it's safe. Everything is great. Everything is just... Whoa! Uh, I mean... Wow! Look at the, um... The way the sun is sparkling off your beautiful tiara! Gotta go! <laughs> Come on! We gotta follow that bird! We're gonna 
to get that tiara back. And Mia will never have to know what happened. That's a jibbity whoop flaw flaw flobbered. And if we call its name, maybe it will open its beak and drop the tiara. Jibbity whoop, jibbity whoop, flaw flaw flaw. Jibbity whoop, jibbity whoop, Jippity whoop, jippity whoop, blah, blah, blah! Oh, ah. <laughs> Eddie, how's my tiara? It's fine. I'm looking at it right now. Gotta go. But, Eddie, why didn't you tell me the truth? Because I told her I'd keep the tiara safe. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> it's best to tell the truth when you make a big mistake. And if you tell the truth, you know you might just get a break. And when you quit your fibbing, your friends will understand. But there's no need to tell. It's almost in my hand. That voice you hear inside is your guilty conscience calling. And never think for once it is a voice that's worth ignoring. So listen when it says. Help because I got this. Hey, I'm falling! <sighs> oh, oh, ah, 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 ah. I've looked everywhere and I don't see the tiara. It's like it just walked away. Now what are we gonna do? We'll never get the tiara back in time to crown the queen. And there's the royal jungle throne. Eddie! Mia, just about to call. We're gonna crown the queen with your tiara, which I kept away from the, the, from the... Alligators! And the flying fox! Alligators and flying frogs! Crowning time! Gotta go! Oh, rats. Come on, Mr. Butterfly. We're going to find out what's happened to my tiara. How are we going to crown the queen if we don't have a crown? Crown! Crown! Uh, not a problem. You're gonna crown her with that? <sighs> I don't know what else to do. Jungle Queen, it is our honor to bring you this crown after our long and difficult journey. What is that? Mia, what are you doing here? I was worried about my tiara. Now where is it? Wow! I mean, wow, it's right here. I only gave you that fake crown in case the alligators or flying frogs. <sighs> I don't want to lie anymore, Mia. There weren't any alligators or flying frogs. And I meant to be careful, but I wasn't. And I lost your tiara. And I didn't tell you the truth because I didn't want you to get mad. Because you told the truth, I grant you a royal pardon. I forgive you, Eddie. Thank you, Mia. That was really nice of you. Just a minute, sister. Thanks for keeping the throne warm, but you're not the real queen of Jungle Land, because I am. I'm sorry. Of course, your royal turtleness. Uh, tortoiseness. Your Highness, we didn't recognize you without your queenly attire. Are you going to keep my tiara? Don't worry. I've been carrying that thing around all day, and it's heavy. <gasps> now that's a crown I could get used to. All right! Hooray! Oh, yeah! And now, everyone's other favorite game show is Eddie going to give me a scoop of strawberry ice cream? Eddie, are you going to give me a scoop? 
scoop of strawberry ice cream? Like you promised? Yes! Yay! Eddie, you're our winner! Mmm, and so am I. <laughs> <laughs> okay, when I say three, ready? One, two, three. Hey guys, what you doing? Playing the game for big kids. Can I play? You can try, but you might be too little. Yeah, we're seeing who can jump up and hang from the monkey bar the longest. And you've got to be super strong. Or half orangutan. Are you part orangutan? I don't think so. But I can pick you up. <laughs> easy, easy, Kobe, squeezy. Well, okay, but don't blame me if your arms fall off. I won't. Okay, ready? One, two, three! You're right, this is hard. Guys, snack time! Yay! <laughs> Maybe she is half orangutan. What's for snack, Sophie? Jelly. Is that all? Yeah, she found it in the sandbox. Like treasure. Wait, hey, you can't eat that. Why not? We don't know where it's been. Sure we do, in the sandbox. But it's all dirty and there's nothing to spread it on. We've got our fingers. And our tongues. Jack, that's yucky. But it's all we've got for our picnic. Picnic? Why didn't you say so? I love picnics. What a perfectly picnicky idea. But not here. Let's go out into the country. I love the countryside. Let's go. Me too. Yeah. I think I know just the spot. Come on, you two. We're going to stay and um, keep an eye on the jelly. <laughs> And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Definitely eat here. Just smell all that countryness. <sighs> well, I guess it's okay. What do you mean, okay? It's beautiful! Look at all the pretty flowers! Well, they're pretty, but they're sort of yucky, too. They're not in lines, or rows, or anything. But look at all the butterflies. They're so colorful. They're all right, I guess. There's just not very many of them, are there? Okay, if you don't like it here, we can find someplace else. There must be zillions of nice places around here. Just what I was thinking. <laughs> They're so pretty. Let's eat. I'm hungry as a wolf. <laughs> oh, Fooey. What's the matter, Emma? My dress. It 
it's all muddy. Where? I can't see anything. Here. Oh, it's ruined. That? It's just a little speck. But what about the grass? Um, what about the grass? Don't you think it's a bit too pointy? Too pointy? How can grass be too pointy? Ah. Careful, Eddie. Oh, with all the mud and pointy grass. It's just too yucky here. Hmm, this place isn't good enough either. Do you want us to find another picnic spot instead? Good thinking, Sophie. Come on! <sighs> How about over there? Hmm, well, okay. Let's try it. Really? Sure, I'm not picky. Here will be just fine. Perfect. Well, almost. I'm starving. Let's eat. Hmm. What, what now? now? Listen. Isn't it sweet? Oh, it is sweet. It could just be sweeter, that's all. You're a little off key, little bird. Good luck, little bird. <gasps> what is it, Eddie? Um, the blanket. Wouldn't it be even more perfect over there? You know, you're right. Guys, look! <gasps> oh, no! Ew, it's so slimy and slippery. If Emma sees that snail, she'll never want to have a picnic. You're right. And I'm going to eat my shirt if we have to move again. Well, what are we going to do? I'm not touching it. I know. Just keep Emma distracted. What are you going to do, Eddie? Leave it to me. The blanket's a little bumpy. We'll help. Sorry. This picnic is by invitation only. <gasps> hmm. It might be better. Just over... No! Mm-hmm. Actually, you're right. Sophie? Oh, just a flower. It blew into your hair. Oh, really? No! Oh! I'll get it. Can I see it? Um, well... Oh, it must have blown away. Never mind. I think we're just about ready to eat. <gasps> I just love snails. You do? Of course. They're so cute. They are? Sure. Look at their little shell houses. They're perfect little campers. My gosh. We've been trying to hide it. We thought you might think that it's all slimy and yucky. Yucky? But I love the trails that they leave. So shiny and sparkly. Now, Miss Snail, you can sit next to me as our guest of honor. Can I have a sandwich now? <laughs> of course. <laughs> Silly. Finally. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. So good. Wow. Much better. Jack, not again. But there's still some in the bottom. I can't get any jelly for me now. Eddie, can you help pull it off? I could try, but Mia's way stronger. 
She is? Yeah, I'm half orangutan. <laughs> Thanks, Mia. You're welcome. And I'm welcome to this last little bit of jelly. If I can just get this last itty bitty. Ugh. Oh, rats. <laughs> <laughs> A spaceman went to space, 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 but didn't tie his lace, lace, lace. What you doing, Eddie? I'm going to paint the dog. Paint the dog? Yep, bright green. But you can't do that. Dogs aren't for painting. I want a dinosaur, and I can't find one anywhere. So I want to make the next best thing. A dino puppy. Eddie, you can't paint Lucky. Why not? Getting painted can't be good for dogs. And I wouldn't like it much if I was all wet and sticky. Mm. Mm -hmm. I guess you two are right. And we love him just the way he is. Yes, we do, yes, we do, yes, we do. So where am I going to find a dino puppy? Oh, Eddie, everyone knows dino puppies are almost impossible to train. But they're my favorite animal. My favorite animal is a sea lion. Arr, arr. I like penguins. Lucky is my favorite animal. And bunny rabbits. Uh, bunny rabbits are just the cutest. We should go find some. There are lots of bunnies in fairy tale land. All right. Let's go. <laughs> hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. 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 Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. Ruthie Rabbit. Hey, Ruthie! Well, hey there, y'all. What a nice surprise. We're here to play with your little bundles of fluff. Whoa! <laughs> oh, they are having a good old time. I'm sure they'd love to play. Come on, everybody! <laughs> yeah! Poppy, hop, boing, hop, hop, boing. <laughs> boing, boing, boing. Mm. The flowers smell so sweet this time of year. Mmm, yummy scrummy. <laughs> so, can you jump this high? Hey! -ya! Whoa! Huh? Bernard, you come down from there. <laughs> How does one bouncy bunny? I wish I could bounce that high. I know it's super boingy. What, Mia? The trampoline at the castle. Yeah! Let's go! Are you coming, Ruthie? I don't think these little ones are quite bouncy enough. Thanks all the same. Okay. You have fun now. Emma, are you coming for a bounce? Oh, okay. But I hate to leave these pretty flowers behind. I know. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> You bounce like a bunny, Tessa style. What are you waiting for, Emma? Don't you want to <coughs> bunny bounce? I don't know what to do with my flower. It's so pretty and dainty and delicate. What about the vase? Good thinking, Kobe. Oh, little flower, don't you just look darling? You know, it would look even prettier with some other flowers to keep it company. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> See you later. Hmm. 
<laughs> if Bernard Bunny was on here, he could bounce to the moon. He'd be a space hopper. <laughs> I'm back. Hey, Emma. Look how pretty. Yeah, they're really nice, Emma. Do you want to come bounce now? I do. But now I'm thinking the other side of the room needs to look as special as this side. But the room looks pretty. Just the way it is. Oh, it's pretty, but it's not perfect. A few more flowers and we'll be all set. Back in two shakes of a rabbit's tail. <laughs> Belly bounce! <laughs> <laughs> There. Much better, don't you think? Yeah, good work, Emma. Oh, and the smell. Scrumdilliumptious. Yeah! Now come on! You're missing all the fun! Perfect. Well, not quite. You know, a few more flowers might just finish it off nicely. There are so many empty vases to fill. Okay. We'll save you a place. Hey, guys, do the bunny flop. <laughs> I'm back. Ooh, that was fast. Wow, Emma, that's a lot of flowers. Thanks. Hmm, it would be nice to add just a couple more. Come on, Emma. We'll help you. Oh. Mm. Oh. Yeah, then you can finish decorating and bounce with us. Um, Emma, where did all the flowers go? Oh, they're just over. <gasps> oh, no, there aren't any. I must have picked them all. All of them? I guess so. And where are all the bunnies? And the birds? And butterflies? I got so carried away making everything pretty, I forgot the poor little animals all need the flowers too. Maybe they've gone to find somewhere else to play. What are we gonna do now? Well, I'll just have to make the meadow as beautiful as it was before. But how? Ooh, I've got it. Follow me. Just pop them on the ground like so. And voila! Good as new. Uh, Emma? I'm not sure this is going to work. Yeah, and they're looking all brown and sad. Oh, fooey. I think you're right. What a pickle! Wait, look! What are these? Seeds! We can plant the seeds and grow the flowers all over again. Great idea, Emma. Yeah. This is going to be fun. We have plenty of dirt and sunshine. Now we just need water and lots of it to help the plants grow. But where can we get so much water? <gasps> I know, the fire truck. Come on. <laughs> The rain begin! Yay! 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 It's raining! There, a nice long drink. <gasps> Look! Would you yeah. look at that? I've never seen my little ones so excited. They do love it here. When the flowers grow back, They'll love it just as much as before. I'm sure you're right, sweetie. Bernard! Hello. Care for a bounce? Boing, boing, boing. <laughs> <laughs> tweet, tweet, tweet. Hello? Anybody seen Mrs. Owl? Oh, hello, Mrs. Owl. Say, Mr. Woodpecker, can you keep the banging down? I'm trying to get some sleep. It's not me. Tweet, tweet. 
Excuse us, Earth birds. We have come to take your tree back to our distant planet. Is that okay? Why do you want our tree? Our planet has no trees, and we would like one. But we will make you a fair trade. Please accept this rare sock. It has a unique aroma. Well, this is our home, and I'm afraid it's not for sale. Yeah, it took years and years to grow this tree. But it's big enough to share. Why not come and stay? That is an excellent idea. I would like to be an earth bird very much. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Tweet, 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 Princess Palace. Roar! I should change into my princess dress before snack time. Roar! Ooh, my tummy is grumbly. Roar! I could eat a whole banquet. Roar! Roar! Hi, Eddie. Roar! Watch where you're Whoa! going. Oops, I squished Mia's castle. Oh, no! Hmm, where is Mia? I don't know. She was just here. <gasps> Maybe she disappeared. Mia disappeared? Is the sandbox quicksand? Ah, quicksand! The sandbox is not quicksand. Okay, here's some snacks. <laughs> um, what are you doing? <laughs> We're looking for Mia. She's disappeared. She turned invisible? <laughs> <laughs> Mia! Mia! Are you invisible? <laughs> <laughs> She's going to miss her snack. Maybe aliens took her. <laughs> Maybe they'll make Mia their queen. Maybe we should find out where she is before making things up. <gasps> Look! Maybe she went on her very own adventure. This calls for a search team. Let's take the fire truck. Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Hooray. <laughs> <laughs> friend Mia. Mia! She's about my size and can probably turn invisible. Mia! And she might be an alien queen. <laughs> no! Wait! Eddie! <sighs> We're trying to find Mia, not make everyone scared of her. Mia! But we don't know what happened to her. Exactly. Did you hear? <laughs> Mia is really an invisible alien queen. <gasps> she could be here now. <laughs> What's up with them? So beware! Queen Mia could be arriving any minute with her alien army. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I don't know what planet she's from. I'm sure it's a bad one, though. Invisible and alien, you say? No. Ooh, sounds like this Queen Mia is someone to stay away from. I'll let everyone know. 
You better gallop off before the alien invasion. Alien invasion? Where in the world did you get that idea? Um, well... He told me. Gotta run. <laughs> Wait, come back. <sighs> Eddie, we warned you about spreading rumors. It's going to be a lot harder to find Mia if everybody is trying to avoid her. But I was only... Alien invasion! <laughs> uh, you know, I think you might be right. So, how do we stop the rumors now? Well, I started these rumors, and I think I know how to stop them. How, Eddie? First, we need to find Mia. Then, show everybody that she's not a super-powered alien queen who can turn invisible and has an invisible army and her own planet. When did she get her own planet? Eddie, don't make up more stuff! Right, sorry. Hey, if you skip snack time to go on an adventure, where would you go? I hmm. wonder. Let me think. Hmm. I know! The, the restaurant. restaurant! Let's go! A rumor is a story you don't know is really true. A made-up kind of story, but not the kind it's good to do. Rumors start out small, but then they grow and grow. Till everybody's heard them and they just won't go. I heard this. Aliens all over the Ribbit. Ribbit. And before you know it, they think the story's true. Then you've got a rumor ruckus. Well, I heard that. <laughs> That's a rumor. Keep it under your hat. Bah. Folks think there are aliens living here among us. Just because a rumor ruckus. Ooh. Ooh. It's not good to spread rumors, even if you think they're true. Just imagine how you feel if folks make things up about you. But I heard things. And I heard stuff. Once you hear a rumor, forgetting it's tough. We should really try to stop them, cause enough's enough. That's why it's so important to hear the song we sing. Cause we've got a rumor ruckus. restaurant with her entire invisible alien army! Oh, oh, she oh, is. Oh, I oh, see her. everywhere. Hey everyone, Mia isn't an alien. She's a normal, nice girl. And she's our friend. Aha! There's Mia! <sighs> Hello? Waiter! Anybody there? <laughs> Oh, rats. Can I at least get a menu? <sighs> oh, my. The alien is becoming hostile. That's not an alien. That's Mia. <gasps> but look! The invisible alien army! They filled every seat in the restaurant! Scientific fact. There is no invisible alien army. Mia's all alone in there. <laughs> <laughs> We'll prove it. Come on, guys. Hey, Mia. Hello. There you are. We were worried. We missed you. Whoa, I missed you guys, too. Where'd you all disappear to? <gasps> <gasps> Don't say disappear. Nobody invisible on this chair. Uh, or this one. Huh? Or this one? Or this one! Um, Sophie, what's going on? It's a long story. Maybe you can tell me over a snack. I don't know about anyone else, but I'm starved. Let's eat. <laughs> hmm, I think 
think I'd like to try everything. Yay! She's okay! <laughs> well, I knew she wasn't an alien. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> what should we build next? Another castle? <gasps> or a sand igloo? I heard if we dig a deep enough hole, we can tunnel through the whole earth and come out on the other side and walk upside down. <laughs> Eddie! Or a sand igloo is good, too. I think Lucky agrees. Lucky. <laughs> <laughs> it's neck and neck in the backyard Grand Prix. Here comes the jump. <laughs> yeah! But what's this up ahead? It's a traffic jam. Honk honk. Huh? What's the rush? We're racing here, but we're on a road trip. Uh, on our racetrack? You're right, Kobe. I guess it's not the best place for a road trip. A road trip sounds fun, though. Yeah. Maybe we can go on one together. Let's go! Yeah! Road trip adventure! Did someone say adventure? Go, Ziggy! And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song 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 Hey, hey, we bought an adventure Wait up! Oh, oh, yay! Road trip! All aboard the Eddie Express! Going somewhere exciting? Hmm? We sure are. We're going to. Um, where are we going again? Um, beats me, but I'm driving there. Have you ever been to the bouncy beach? The bouncy beach? That place sounds jumping. Bouncy beach it is! Let's go! <laughs> this is gonna be awesome! <laughs> <clears throat> the bouncy beach is quite easy to find. Just head down go. this road yeah. and take the first left. <laughs> Got that? Hmm? <laughs> left. Don't turn right. <laughs> then go over the bridge go. to the end of the road. Bouncy until beach. you see bouncy <gasps> beach. This is gonna be fun! Got that? Got it. Next stop, bouncy beach. Yeah. All right! <laughs> Remember, take the first left. Um, which way now? What did the peacock say? Hey, don't look at me. I thought you were listening. Well, I was busy. Did anyone hear the directions? Not me. Uh-uh. Nope. <sighs> hey, I've got an idea. Road trip, road trip, let us know. Which way should we choose to go? This way, to the right. Okay, ready, Eddie, go! Yeah! <laughs> Are you sure this is the right road? I'm not even sure this is a road. Bouncy Beach must be around here somewhere. Can you see through all the dust? Not really. So we're not only lost, we can't even see where we're lost. But I want to bounce. Hey, look! A car wash! <laughs> Hello. Hey, can you please clean our camper van? <laughs> Let's see. 
One cup is a quick clean, two cups for a medium clean, and three cups are the full monkey. <gasps> the full monkey! I love monkeys! Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Monkey, you're funny. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, ah, ah. of soap. Oh. Right. We're gonna follow directions. Okay, turn right. Now, turn left. Can anyone see the bubble? Not me. Uh-uh. Nope. <sighs> um, hi, Mr. Giraffe. Did you see our friend float past? She's the one in a bubble. You did? Which way did she go? So we go right and straight ahead. Thanks, Mr. Giraffe. Look! A fork in the road! Hi, Mr. Sloth. Have you seen a girl floating around here anywhere? Oh, yeah. <sighs> I think she went towards Bouncy Beach. You go right, then over the bridge, and keep going to the end of the road. Everyone get that? Yes! Okay, thanks, Mr. Sloth. <laughs> over the bridge and keep going to the end of the road it's bouncy feet oh yeah cool it's beautiful Bubble too. Did you see that? The bubble came down a little bit with Mia inside. I know what to do. Listen, we all need to bounce up to the bubble and get inside it. 
Then our weight will pull it down. Got it. You bet. Um, how are we going to get out? Hmm. Easy. Yay! 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 Good going, Sophie. <laughs> there you go, Lucky. Um, Mia, what are you doing? I'm feeding Lucky. Feeding Lucky? Yep. There's enough food here for a herd of elephants. Didn't you look at the instructions? Well, of course I did. And what did they say? How should I know? I don't know how to read. Here, I'll help you. Thanks, Sophie. <laughs> the delicate snowflake floats on the breeze. I am a delicate snowflake, floaty, floaty, tra-la-la. I do make the most perfect snowflake, don't I? Mm-hmm. Here comes the Ediosaurus. Run! Ribbit, ribbit. Shh, we're making a movie. I'm a frog. Ribbit. A movie? Want a dinosaur in it? But it's called the Snowflake and the Frosty Frog. <laughs> Sorry, Eddie. Everyone knows dinosaurs don't like it when it's cold out. Ribbit? It's not that cold. You're right. We should go someplace that's really snowy. Like in a snow globe. Let's go to Snowglobia. We can make a really great movie there. Come on, Sophie. Let's go! Me too! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Wintry! The snow will look so pretty and sparkly in our movie. Yeah. Now, what are we going to film? What in the name of sneezing snowballs is going on? Look! Oh, a little snow monkey. How cute. I think the poor guy's stuck. Oh, Fooey, what are we going to do? Don't worry, Eddie is always ready to help. <laughs> now that's a movie. Double knot. There, all better. Ah, it was nothing, little guy. I think we should. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, uh, nothing. We just thought of something we want to do. That's all. Wait, where are you going? Oh, just going to do stuff. What kind of stuff? <laughs> secret stuff. What kind of secret stuff? You'll find out later. Come on, Sophie. Well, 
I've got stuff to do, too. Ah, ah, ah. Fun stuff with my new friend. Ah, ah. My new friend, Ack. Looks like their secret is that they want to have fun without me. Ah. Well, we'll have way more fun without them. Just you and me, Ack. Come on. Ah, ah, ah. So, my furry little friend, what kind of fun do you think? <laughs> hmm. Well, whatever fun we have needs to get us away from those silly giggles. I know! Let's build a snow fort! We can play in it together! On our own! Are you okay? <laughs> They're being weird. Come on, Ack. We've got a snow fort to build. Good work, Ack. This is going to be the best. Man. <laughs> he can guard our snow fort and stop anyone else from getting in. <laughs> I'll make the body and you can make the head. are definitely going to want to come in. But they're not invited. Eddie! Eddie! That didn't take long. Sorry, you can't come in because you're not invited. It's only for me and my real friends. Huh? We are your real friends. And we don't want to come in. We want you to come out. If you were my real friend, you wouldn't have gone off to play without me, and you wouldn't have told secrets, and you wouldn't have... Uh, what's going on? They're all here for you. For me? What? Why? Emma and I have been making a special project just for you. Huh? Oh, oh, oh. You were so brave. And so nice when you got Ack out of the tree, we decided to make you something special. Come on. So, we made a little movie to show everyone how helpful and great you are. You did? nice surprise for me, and the whole time I was mad because I thought you were leaving me out of your fun. Oh, Eddie, we didn't realize. I'm the one who didn't realize. I shouldn't have jumped to confusions. Don't you mean conclusions? Exactly. I'm sorry. 
We still friends? Of course. <laughs> Look, other head, what on Earth planet is that thing? It is fuzzy. Maybe a fairy rock? Hmm. Rocks do, do not, not yawn. yawn. It, it must, must be a sleepy Earth, Earth monster. <laughs> <laughs> Two-headed alien robot from another planet? That is not a sleepy monster. It's only Lucky, our dog. Uh-oh, other head, we have miscomputed error. Error. It is just, we have never heard of such a thing. You've never heard of pets? Of course we have heard of pets, but on our planet, everyone knows that the best pets are... Pineapples. <laughs> Meet our pineapple pet, Spike. Sit, Spike. Stay. Good pineapple. Fetch, Spike. Go on. You can do it. Mm. Our pet is sleepy, too. What animal is that? Uh, uh. A walrus? A panda bear? Uh, <laughs> I'm a lamb, but I've got a little sniffle. Hey, can I play whatever you're playing? Sure, we're all animals. Moo! <laughs> oh, I thought I made a wrong turn and wound up at the farm. Don't I sound just like a little lamb? But I don't know. Do lambs sneeze? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't we go to the farm and see? Yeah! Aww. Let's go on the farm adventure. Hey, Emma! Kobe! Are you coming? No, I think we're going to stay here. Yeah! Kobe's showing me how to make an airplane. Mine is going to fly like the wind. <laughs> but first, you've got to make that music. Yeah! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song Sing this song Sing this song Fuzzy, do you ever get the sniffles? <laughs> Jack, you can be a horse with us if you want. Sure you've got enough? <laughs> sure, there's a whole barrel over there. <laughs> what? It was just one little wrapper. Easy juggling with horsey hooves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't worry. It's just one little egg. I don't know why it's not dinging now. Maybe you lost the little dingy thingy. 
I guess so. Well, now it's broken and no use to a cow like me. Hot choo! <laughs> Relax, Chicky Chicky. It's just one little tissue. Oh well, I guess it's junk now. What? It's just one little broken bell. Great juggling, Tessa. Thanks. Wait, it's just one little apple core. Hey, can you show me how to juggle? Sure. Just toss each one up as soon as you catch it. See? Whoa! Broken cowbell. And your tissue, Mia. And your egg, Tessa. And my apple core. And isn't that your wrapper, Jack? All of these things together sure add up to a lot of trash. But it was just one little wrapper. Yeah, but all this little stuff makes one big mess. <laughs> and I don't think the chickens are too happy about all this trash. <laughs> Well, I say we do something about it. We all made the mess so we can clean it up together. Good idea, Sophie. Yeah, come on, let's roll. I believe this is yours. Thanks, but it's kind of gooey. What can I do with it? Put it in the trash can, of course. Let me find out where it is. Hold your horses. Nee! <laughs> Have you seen a trash can around here, partner? <laughs> Over here! Giddy up! Nee! <laughs> Nay! Bop, 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 bop. Move! But. Oh, rats! Got it! Silly tissue! Get back Ugh. here! Ah! That's how to catch a tissue. Chicken style! <laughs> Thanks, chickadee. Good as... No, no, no! No. <laughs> <laughs> So, make sure the wings are stuck on nice and tight. Uh-huh. And give it a try. Okay, here goes. Whee! <laughs> wow, Emma, can I fly the plane after you? Sure. <gasps> oh dear, a tiny birdie is in there, and she looks a little scared. Aw, poor little thing. If we give her some space, she might come out. Maybe some food will help. A better world is waiting, it's closer than you know. A little bit of kindness can set this world aglow. You can find it on the map or up there in the stars. It's spinning deep inside of you, this place we can call ours. Let's discover a better world where we all do our part. Let's discover a better world. Just look inside your heart. Yesterday has gone away. Tomorrow's getting near 
But today is where we are. Let's change things while we're here. It's not about who you are. It's how you choose to live. It's not about what you have. It's what you have to give. Let's discover. To fly to some place far away. The dreaming dreams won't get us there. Our actions are the way. The world can be a better place. There's much that we can do. This place can be a better world. It all begins with you. Let's discover. Good artist! Thanks! Hmm... Now the trick is staying inside the lines with the paint and using just the right colors to... <gasps> a purple sun? Isn't it pretty? Oh, yes, but the sun is more yellow. Uh, I just thought it was pretty. Purple is pretty. Oh... Um, what you doing, Emma? Bedazzling the pig pen. Oh, well, pig pens aren't really very bedazzly, so let's just stick with farm colors, okay? Here's some nice brown paint. A perfect shade of mud. Oh, brown. Yuck. I mean, thanks. Okay, <laughs> that's great, Jack. A blue sheep. Blue sheep? I know. So funny, right? Not as funny as your dinosaur. Dinosaur? There's not supposed to be a dinosaur. What's a farm without a dinosaur? Uh, a farm? That would look nice with glitter. Farms don't have glittery dinosaurs. Can't we just do it my way? The way it's supposed to be? <sighs> I should probably wash off this paint. Yeah, me too. Aww. <sighs> we'll paint the farm with you, Sophie. Yeah. I'm not in the mood anymore. How about we go on an adventure? To a real farm. It'll be farm-tastic. Yeah, let's go. Great idea. Two, three, four. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure, and you can come along. A special kind of adventure, but first we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. What is going on? I don't know. Hey, guys. Hi, Bernie. Hi, Bernie. Hi, Bernie. You here for the games? Games? The great goat games. You could be a great goat games gold champion. Ooh, I want to be a great gold goat. Whatever it is, I want to be a champion. Me too. Can we play? Well, you'll have to ask Biff. He's the goat in charge. Sorry, you don't play by my rules. You don't play at all. Better luck next time. Not. <laughs> Hello. 
I'm Biff. That's Crash and Bash. You here to play? You bet we are. If that's okay with you, Mr. Biff. Oh, that's fine. Isn't it, fellas? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't trust these guys. Don't worry. We're gonna win this thing. You just go right ahead and do that. Start at the starting line and finish at the finish line. Then you'll be a great Goat Games Gold Champion. Quite simple, really. <laughs> Let the Goat Games begin! <laughs> On your marks, get set. Goat! <laughs> well, this isn't so hard. Whoa! <laughs> We're going to be champions! Yeah. <laughs> hold it! Hold it! Hold it! Whoa! Hey, hey, I am such a scatterbrain! One tiny little rule. You gotta run the course with one eye closed. Well, hmm. okay. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Silly me! One other rule. One leg off the ground. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, rats! Hear me up. Hang on, hang on. Another rule. Uh, two rules, actually. You gotta do it backwards, holding your breath. <laughs> But that's well, how not are we it. supposed hey, to... Hey, whoa! Don't you want to be Great Goat Games Gold Champions? Yeah, <sighs> I guess so. <laughs> oh! I forgot the best part. Sorry, did I mention the watermelons? There are watermelons. Oh, it looks like we got no winners. Too bad. <laughs> Thank you for playing the goat games. Come back soon, but not really. <laughs> that wasn't very fair. I know, and I'm beat. Let's just rest in here a while. Guess we're not the only ones who didn't win. <laughs> <sighs> you know what? We couldn't win. That Biff just makes up rules as he goes along. Kobe's right. That is not fair. They're bullies. That's all they are. Yeah, yeah, I that's agree. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Whoa. We don't have to play Biff's game. We can make our own games. But he's in charge. What if he gets mad at us? Maybe we should just stay here. That's what bullies want you to do. Nothing. Who wants to go have some fun? We, we do! do. <laughs> Let's show those bullies that we don't have to play their game. Let's go, gang. <laughs> Better luck next time. <laughs> well, I think that's everyone. Now they'll know who makes the rules around here. <laughs> yeah, you're the guy. <laughs> Whoa, what is that? Well, I can't do whatever that is unless I tell them they can do whatever that is. Go over there and see what's going on, will you? <laughs> Here comes Crash and Bash! <laughs> hey, I wanna play too! Uh... Okay, sure! Come on! <laughs> this is fun! <laughs> I wanna be... Hey, hey, hey! You, you, you! <laughs> you can't tell me! <laughs> Crash! Bash! Hey, you bitch! <laughs> I want a full report! Guys! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> What do you think you're doing? Playing? Why? I got some rules for you. That's why. We have our own rules, Biff. One, anyone can play. Two, everyone plays fair. And three, everyone...
everyone is fun and no one's a bully. <laughs> Want to join in? Okay, <laughs> up to you. See ya. <laughs> Come back. Let's have some more fun. <laughs> <laughs> I, um, I was wondering if... What were those rules again? Anyone can play. Everyone has fun and no bullying. I guess I could give it a try, if it's okay. Sure. Anyone can play, if they play nicely. I'm coming in! <laughs> I'm <next>. <laughs> <Got> you! <laughs> I guess even bullies can learn new rules. And how to have fun. And you know what else? What? You're it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get you back! <laughs> hey, Kobe, is that a spaceship over the farm? Uh, yeah. It's great! And Emma, nice bedazzling. I bet the pigs will love that. Oh, Eddie, I think your dinosaur looks lonely. Maybe paint another one. Okay, but... What about making us do it your way, Sophie? It's way better if everyone can just have fun. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna paint my spaceship another color. This <laughs> fun! Yay! Yay! I'm gonna win this time. <laughs> Nuh-uh, I'm faster. Nuh-uh. Faster, faster! Oh, I counted nine. So, how many to go? Why? Getting tired? Uh-uh. First pass, Lucky's the fastest. <laughs> yeah! It's a tie! Again. <sighs> How are we going to prove that I'm the fastest? Huh? You mean that I'm the fastest, and I'm happy to prove it anywhere, anytime, rain or shine. Hmm. How about snow? Aw, oh, that's easy. But you never raced on snow. Well, it's about time we did. You're on. Yeah, we can go to Snow Globia. Yeah! Oh, yippee! Yeah. Take it away, Ziggy! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Did it 
to do. Ooh, wait for Princess Snowflake. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Champion coming through! Oh, yeah! <gasps> so long! Thanks for coming! Ooh. Get ready to eat my snow! Whoa! Mm. Mm. Whoa! Mm -mm. What? Did I just... Wipe out? Totally. Are you okay? I think so. Come on, not so steady, Eddie. Let's get back to the race. Whoa! Wow. Mm. Uh. <sighs> um, I, I, I don't want to race anymore. What? Steady Eddie giving up already? Come on, Eddie. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Come on, Eddie. If you don't race, how can I win? I... I just don't think... I just don't want to, okay? <gasps> oh, boy. He's taking that fall pretty hard. Yeah. Poor Eddie. Here comes Princess Snowflake! <laughs> oh, double rats! Can someone... Coming, Princess Snowball! <laughs> it's Snowflake! They can keep their saucers. I'm never riding one again. Huh? Penguins can't do that. Wow. How'd you do that? I've never even seen those moves. Whoa, incredible. Oh, I don't think I can... Wait a minute. Is it magical? A magic snow saucer? So it is magic. So that's how a little penguin like you can do all those tricks. Well, if it is magic, maybe I won't fall off. Here goes. Whoa. The magic works! Saucer really is magic. I can beat anyone on this. <laughs> so long, little guy, and thanks. Eddie, where are you? Hey. You're back on your snow saucer. Huh? Well, are you ready? Um, yeah, I think so. Come on. Eddie, you're back. I've been, um, practicing. Okay, let's settle this once and for all. Okay, first pass Kobe Snowman is the winner. Hey, guys, over here. On your marks, get set, snow! <laughs> Wait. <sighs> Another tie. No way! Oh. Eddie, don't you want to try again? <sighs> it wasn't a fair race. You really won, Tessa. But Kobe said it was a tie. But it wasn't a tie. Not really. My snow saucer is magic. It did the work, not me. Tessa, 
You're the fastest. Magic snow saucer? Yeah, a little penguin let me borrow it. A little penguin? Uh-huh. But I saw that penguin pick up your saucer right after you left. You did? So it isn't magic? And that means all the racing you did just now was... All me? All you. Maybe you just needed your confidence back. So it was a tie. And you both are the fastest. No, I am. One more race. Okay, you're on. Hey, everyone. Whoa! <laughs> Princess Snowflake, are you okay? Ugh. It's Snowball. Just call me Snowball. <laughs> what you doing? Watching a snail. Oh, yeah? Why, hello there, young snail. I like how he kind of wriggles. Yeah, but really, really slowly. I'm a great wriggler. Hey, so am I. But I can wriggle really slowly. Yeah, but I can wriggle the slowest. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> Kobe, you have to hold still. Mm. Is it done yet? Ugh, I'm never going to finish if you keep moving. Is it ready now? No, now sit still. But I want to see it. Kobe, you're making me mess it all up. Ah! What happened to your face? Sophie's painting a kangaroo face on me. That is definitely not a kangaroo. It would have been if Kobe had sat patiently. Well, maybe it's a monster! Roar! <laughs> you can't get me! Roar! Roar! <laughs> 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 That's better. Okay, ready. It's time for another adventure. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. This is gonna be fun. Hi, Leonard. Where are you going? I'm about to hit the skies, heading for the new carousel ride. It's the hottest thing in fairy tale land. They've got punk rock ponies. Punk rock ponies? Let's go! Yeah, can we fly with you, Leonard? Love carousels. Sorry, no can do. The next flight's all full. Ah, <sighs> oh, rats. Aw, oh, come on. We really want to go. Well, I might be able to squeeze in one more passenger. Me, 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 me. me. Ooh, pardon, excuse me. Da -da 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 -da. Me, 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 me. Sorry. That's not fair. Well, if you all wait patiently, I can drop them off and come straight back for you. That would be great. Thanks, Leonard. But you'll have to promise that you'll wait. I don't want to come all the way back if you're not going to be here. No problem. We'll be here. Of course. Punk Rock Ponies, here we come. Hmm, I can't wait. Well, you're going to have to. 
we're all going to have to be a little bit patient. How long does being patient take? Uh, it can't take that long. Okay, well, let's wait then. Bored. Tessa style. Me too. Maybe we should play a game? Zoom! <gasps> With dinosaurs! Grr! Roar! 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 Hey! I have a stapler. Want a staple step? That's not a game. Roar! Roar! The plane will be back soon. We just have to be patient. But my brain is so full of excitement, there's no room for patience. <gasps> I'm good at a lot of stuff, but I'm not very good at being patient. If I wait anymore, I'm gonna explode! Have you ever seen a dinosaur explode? It's a mess. Hey, wait! Room for one more? Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. But Eddie, we have to wait here for the plane to come back. Well, I have to get to the carousel. It's an emergency. But, uh, Eddie. Come on, guys. See ya. Uh, okay. Y'all, but could you point me and the youngins toward the new carousel ride? It's that way. I can show you. Why, thank you, sweetie. Hop aboard. <laughs> Mia, what about the plane? We're supposed to be patient. Oh, yeah. Patient. Well, bye. <sighs> hey, Andy. Well, hey there, Missy. Say, y'all headed to the carousel? We sure are. Need a lift? That would be great. Thank you. But Sophie, aren't we supposed to wait for the plane? I know it's good to be patient and wait, but sometimes you've got to answer when opportunity knocks. Like right now. Come on. All righty, if you say so. But guys, wait. Being patient is hard work. Ready to go, sport? You're back! Of course. But where is everyone else? They couldn't wait. But you could. Thanks for being patient, my man. We'll be at the carousel in no time. Yeah! Next stop, the carousel. Punk rock ponies, here we come. Roger that, Captain. This carousel is jumping. Yeah, those horsey hooves have got the moves. Get into the groove. First, I just waited patiently for Leonard and we flew here. Lickety split. Giddy up, ponies. <sighs> <clears throat> but I really want to turn. I think we're going to have to wait. <sighs> You mean we have to be patient? Again? I guess we weren't very patient before. 
so now we have to wait. Well, this dinosaur isn't going to make the same mistake twice. Me neither. Get in line, everybody! <laughs> doing, Mia? Waiting patiently. Waiting for what? Waiting for my hair to grow long. Doesn't that take a really long time? Uh-huh. Well, I'll wait with you. Thanks. So, what are you waiting for? I'm waiting to grow taller. Okay. Hmm. You know, we can still do other stuff while we wait. We can? Sure. That's still being patient. Oh, okay then. Wanna go wait patiently on the pogo sticks? Great idea, Mia. <laughs> <laughs> Does my hair look longer? I think so. And do I look taller yet? Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> for the best bedazzling is to take it nice and slowly. Ta-da! I'm amazing! Wow! Nice, Emma. So pretty. Um, well, I think it needs a little more... Mm. There! Look at all that mm. Now that's bedazzled. Oh, no, 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 Mia. That's besplattered. It's all about taking your time and putting things in just the right place. But I like slapping them down and spreading them around like this. Mia, and I'll do it the right way. You'll see. My side's gonna be so, so beautiful. Well, I get the gems. I get the glitter. I get the glue. It doesn't look like we are going to get a turn. But I wanted to make something sparkly. Wait, I have an idea. Let's all go to Snow Globia! Yeah, we can make something sparkly with all that sparkly snow. You guys want to come to Snow Globia? I'm staying here to finish my bedazzling. Well, if Emma is staying, then so am I. Okay, see you later. Whoa, 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 whoa. Snow Globia? Let's go! Yeah. Just as soon as the yard stops spinning around. <laughs> hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song.
should we make? A speedboat. No, wait. A llama. Wait, wait, wait. A time machine. No, I was thinking more like... More like a sparkly ice palace. <laughs> Loretta? Loretta, you come back here. I'm not going to tell you again. And you too, Bernard. And Eunice. You listen to Mama now. <laughs> I can wait. <sighs> oh, dear. I am never going to get my igloo finished at this rate. Igloo? I was hoping to sleep in it tonight. It gets even colder when the sun goes down. Maybe we could help. We were going to make something in the snow anyhow. Hey! <laughs> Loretta, I'm warning you. Eddie and I can look after your babies. We can? We can. And we'll help you make the igloo. Oh, thank you. A mama's work is never done. Now, let me show you the plans. I've started building it just over here. It looks like we're going to have some fun. Bunny style. Where'd they go? <laughs> Come back, bunnies! Hmm, let's see. Wow, you've got big plans for this little igloo. I sure do. A room for each of the young'uns and one for yours truly. Okay, Kobe and I can build two rooms, and you and Jack can build the other two. But we better follow the plan so we build it right. Right? Or we could just build like crazy. Eddie and I have a special treat for you. Look, we made a snowman. <laughs> you can make your own, but just be careful. <laughs> hey, come back here. How's this? Move it a teeny tiny bit towards me. How's this? A teenier, weenier bit the other way. Kobe, make up your mind. Oh, no! <sighs> Whoops. Hey, rabbits, wait up, you guys! <laughs> Look, here they come! Tessa, nice and slow. Ah! How's this? I don't know. It doesn't exactly match the plans. Already? Yep. All done. Oh, dear. This wasn't my plan. But you didn't even look at the plans. All you've done is plan. You guys haven't built a thing. Have to. Have not. We have to, Jack. Now, now, you're carrying on worse than my youngins. Well, what are we going to do now? Going too fast didn't work. And going too slow didn't work either. So what we've got to do is work somewhere in between. Quickly but carefully. Well, let's get a move on. It's getting dark. <laughs> well, if you can't beat them, join them. What do you say we take these baby bunnies back? You 
took the words right out of my... Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> and just in time. <sighs> Look at them, my little snow angels, all tuckered out. They're not the only ones. I hope they weren't too much trouble. Well... No, no, no trouble at all. <laughs> hey! Loretta? What have I told you about snowballs? <laughs> hey, you guys! Over here! Girls, boys, and sleeping dogs. <sighs> May we present our Emma Credible in Mia Magical Joint Creation! The Sparkly Razzle Bedazzlement! Wow. Beautiful! Wow, it's very... It's very both of you! Your big, sloppy sparkles are great, Mia! And your just so jewels are the best, Emma! They work well together! 